Uh, say hello to my guests, Yvette Nicole Brown, Scott M. Gimple, and Melissa McBride here. So, people are having a lot of emotions right now. You know, obviously, oh my God, is Rick gonna die? Is he gonna go off? What's gonna happen? So it looks like he survived. Is this really the end of Rick? Is this some weird trick? What's happening, Scott Gimple? This is not a weird trick. Okay. Uh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this is uh, the end of Rick Grimes on The Walking Dead. Okay. But this is not the end of Rick Grimes' story. Uh, we are gonna continue telling Rick Grimes' story in a series of AMC original films. <gasps> uh, there's a lot of story to tell, and uh, we can't wait to get started and showing you all the stuff that we. So you're gonna make movie movies. You're gonna make movies. We're gonna make uh, AMC original films. Okay. Uh, and, and what can we expect from like what? Is, how does that? How does that tie into the Walking Dead universe? And what's gonna happen with the universe? Well, it um, it expands the universe. It's gonna show a whole different corner of the world. It's gonna show a uh, different situation that Rick is involved in. Uh, these are gonna be shown on AMC right now, but they're gonna have uh, the scope of feature films. These are, you know, we are in an age now when uh, we are making feature films for the, the television boxes. Mm -hmm. And uh, they're gonna be at that level. Um, and we're gonna be seeing an epic story told over years. Wow. So are the films only part of what we can expect from the Walking Dead universe? Uh, we have, the. The big thing that we're doing now is this Rick Grimes story, but we are gonna be telling a uh, new series in different lengths, shorter series, longer series. We're gonna be doing specials, we're working on that now. We're working on uh, digital content, we're working on things that are not easy to describe at the moment. <laughs> um, you're gonna see characters that are gone, uh, dead and gone. We're gonna see stories of their past. We're gonna see different stories of uh, future characters. And uh, we're just gonna be telling Walking Dead stories in different ways. Uh, we're gonna see all around the world. <gasps> we're gonna see the past, we're gonna see the present. We might see the future. I'm um, very excited. I don't yes. know about anybody else. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And so it's, this and is it's, what you've run on, this is what you're doing now in this position. Like you probably, you haven't been able to talk about this, and I didn't know about no. any of this until today. No. So nice. you, yeah. this, is, this is what you're, you're going off and building now, this extended that is universe. And it's, uh, it's a very uh, long-term plan. We're not gonna throw all of this at you guys at once. And some of it is gonna speak to each other, and they're gonna be all connected, and some of it will be totally on its own. Well, just don't don't forget that when you make the Walking Dead movies, that you need to also make a Talking Dead movie. I'm just saying <laughs> that would be the only fair thing to do. Yeah. Um, but let's 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 get to the big story at hand, which is which is Andy. This is from Sharpie D on Twitter. Melissa, what is the most valuable thing you learned from working with Andrew Lincoln? Mm. So many things. Um, He's just so admirable, and it's such a rarity to be able to work with somebody who, somebody like him. Uh, um, I think the most valuable thing is just just him, experiencing him, seeing how he approaches work, seeing how he approaches everyone at work. He has such a care, a genuine care and concern for the cast, the crew, everybody mm -hmm. involved, their part on the show, within the show, and that person, per he has a personal relationship with everybody on this show, and it's beautiful to see. It's really mind-blowing to think that this has been a nine, this nine-year journey has happened. And Yvette, uh, you got to go over to London and sit down with him. What can we expect from the chat that you guys had? Well, first of all, he was looking good, smelling good, and talking good. <laughs> Let me just put that out there. That, that, we assumed all that was he true. He is a delicious man. Um, <laughs> In every way. Um, but also, he, he shares things about what behind the scenes stuff that we, uh, you know, while he was shooting the episode and just wonderful stories about everyone. You guys are gonna really enjoy it. It was it's such an honor to be there with him.